Welcome to Blessed Blissful Broadcast, a channel committed to harmonizing health and happiness. Today we delve into an intriguing relationship between our diets and our minds, a connection studied in depth by the esteemed Dr. Hal Cranmer. His research focuses on the carnivore diet and its potential benefits for a debilitating condition that affects millions globally, Alzheimer's dementia. In the simplest terms, Alzheimer's is a progressive disease that slowly erodes an individual's memory and thinking skills. Over time, it strips away the essence of who we are, leaving behind a shell of the person we once were. Medically speaking, it's a form of neurodegeneration, a gradual loss of neuron function that leads to cognitive impairment. Now let's introduce the carnivore diet into the mix. This diet, as the name suggests, revolves around the consumption of animal products. We're talking about a dietary regimen rich in meats, both white and red, that could potentially provide a solution to Alzheimer's dementia. According to Dr. Cranmer's research, certain nutrients found in meats, such as omega-3 fatty acids, high-quality proteins, and specific vitamins, have a significant impact on brain health. They can potentially slow down the process of neurodegeneration and even aid in cognitive function recovery. The premise here is that by fueling our bodies with these nutrients, we're giving our brains the tools they need to fight back against the ravages of Alzheimer's. It's an approach that challenges conventional wisdom and opens up a new avenue of hope for those living with this condition. As we explore this topic further, we'll delve into the nuances of the carnivore diet discussing which meats offer the most benefits and how to incorporate this diet into your lifestyle. We'll also look at the scientific evidence backing up these claims, laying out the facts in a way that's easy to understand, yet remains rooted in professional medical research. This connection between diet and dementia might seem far-fetched, but the science behind it is fascinating. So stay tuned as we continue our journey into the world of health and happiness on Blessed Blissful Broadcast. As we delve deeper into the science, the connection becomes clearer. We begin by understanding the basic terms associated with our study. Alzheimer's dementia is a neurological condition characterized by cognitive dysfunction and memory loss, thought to be caused by abnormal protein buildups in the brain. The carnivore diet, on the other hand, is a nutritional plan focusing exclusively on animal products, primarily meats. Now, how does the carnivore diet relate to brain health? Well, it all comes down to the nutrients found in animal products, proteins and fats. Proteins, composed of amino acids, are essential to our bodies, playing a key role in almost every biological process, including the functioning of our brain cells. Fats, particularly the high amounts of saturated fats found in meats, provide a vital source of energy for the brain. Moreover, our brain is predominantly made up of fats. Yes, you heard it right, about 60% of the human brain is fat, making it the fattiest organ in the body. This fat is crucial for maintaining the integrity of brain cells and promoting effective signal transmission. The carnivore diet, rich in proteins and fats, provides ample fuel for the brain potentially enhancing cognitive function and memory. This is where the potential benefits for Alzheimer's patients come into play. The study we're discussing suggests that a diet high in animal proteins and fats might help slow cognitive decline in Alzheimer's patients by providing crucial nutrients to support brain health. The diet's high protein content could also help counteract muscle loss, often associated with Alzheimer's, while the fats could provide much needed energy for brain function. This is not to suggest that the carnivore diet is a cure for Alzheimer's, but it could be a valuable tool in managing the condition and enhancing quality of life. In essence, the carnivore diet could be a game changer for those battling Alzheimer's dementia. As we continue to explore and understand the intricate workings of our brain and the impacts of nutrition on our health, we uncover new possibilities and hope for those living with cognitive disorders. Now that we've unveiled the science, how about putting this carnivore diet into action? Indeed, the carnivore diet is more than just a trend. It's a lifestyle change that requires commitment and understanding. So let's delve into how we can effectively implement this diet. First and foremost, the carnivore diet is primarily about consuming animal products. This means your plate will be filled with various types of meat. However, not all meats are created equal. It's crucial to opt for high-quality meats, 
ideally from grass-fed or pasture-raised animals. These sources provide a higher nutrient density and are generally free from the harmful additives often found in factory farmed meat. The types of meats that work best in a carnivore diet are those rich in both protein and fat. Think along the lines of beef, pork, lamb, and salmon. Organ meats like liver and heart are also excellent choices, offering a powerhouse of nutrients that are hard to find elsewhere. Now how do you incorporate this into your daily life? Start by making simple swaps. Instead of reaching for that morning toast, opt for eggs and bacon. Lunch could be a juicy steak instead of a salad. For dinner, consider a hearty lamb stew or grilled salmon. Of course, it's essential to listen to your body and adjust accordingly. If you feel sluggish or experience digestive issues, it might be a sign to adjust your meat intake or diversify the types of meat you're consuming. While this diet may seem restrictive initially, remember that there's a world of culinary possibilities within the realm of meat. Experiment with different cuts, cooking methods, and seasonings to keep your palate excited. Finally, it's crucial not to forget about hydration. While this diet is high in protein and fat, it's low in carbohydrates, which can lead to increased water loss. So make sure you're drinking plenty of water throughout the day. Remember, it's not just about eating meat, it's about choosing the right kind and maintaining balance. In all our pursuits of health, we must not forget the soul. It's a profound statement that resonates with us on so many levels. But what does it truly mean? How does it tie to our topic today, the carnivore diet and Alzheimer's dementia? To shed light on this, let's look at a beautiful verse from the Bible, Psalms 23 verse 3. He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. This verse speaks volumes about the healing and restoration of our soul, an aspect often overlooked in our health journey. In the context of our topic, this verse is incredibly relevant. While we've been exploring the carnivore diet's benefits on physical health, particularly in Alzheimer's dementia, it's critical to remember that health is not merely the absence of disease. It is a state of complete physical, mental, and spiritual well-being. The carnivore diet, with its emphasis on nutrient-dense, unprocessed foods, aids in restoring physical health. The absence of disease symptoms, improved energy levels, and enhanced cognitive functioning can significantly impact our mental well-being. But what about the soul? How does it fit into this picture? The soul thrives on peace, contentment, and a sense of purpose. When our bodies are functioning optimally and our minds are clear, we can focus on nurturing our soul. We can engage in activities that bring us joy, spend time in nature, meditate, pray, or simply enjoy moments of quiet reflection. These actions feed our soul, restore our spirit, and lead us on the path of holistic well-being. In essence, the carnivore diet, or any healthful lifestyle change for that matter, is not just about reducing disease symptoms or enhancing physical health. It's about creating a conducive environment for the soul to flourish. So remember, as you embark on this journey towards better health, don't just focus on your body. Pay attention to your mind and your soul too. Because as the Bible verse reminds us, true healing and health encompass all these aspects. The journey to health is not just about the body, but also about nurturing the soul. At Blessed Blissful Broadcast, we believe in empowering you with knowledge and inspiration. As we draw to the close of this enlightening journey, Let's take a moment to reflect on the key takeaways. We've delved into the intriguing connection between the carnivore diet and Alzheimer's dementia and discovered a fascinating world of science that supports this link. The carnivore diet, rich in proteins from meats like beef, chicken, and fish, has proven to be a potential game changer in combating the effects of Alzheimer's dementia. We've also explored the practical implementation of the carnivore diet showing you how it can be seamlessly incorporated into your daily life. The diet isn't just about consuming meat, it's about selecting the right kinds of meat, those rich in nutrients and beneficial brain-boosting compounds. And we've taken a moment to nourish the soul, remembering the biblical verse from 3 John 1 verse 2. Beloved, I pray that all may go well with you, and that you may be in good health as it goes well with your soul. This verse reminds us that our physical health and spiritual well-being are intrinsically linked, 
a principle that underpins everything we do here at Blessed Blissful Broadcast. To all our loyal viewers, we extend our deepest gratitude for your time and engagement. It is your thirst for knowledge and your dedication to improving your health that drives us to provide you with the best content. And to those who are new here, a warm welcome to our Blessed Blissful Broadcast family. We're thrilled to have you with us on this journey towards a healthier, more fulfilling life. We promise to continue enlightening you with the most recent scientific findings, practical health tips, and soul-nourishing content. Before we part ways, do us a favor and hit that subscribe button. Your support is what allows us to keep producing content that empowers and inspires. Stay blessed, stay blissful, and we'll see you in the next broadcast.